Hi, welcome back to Let's Play Bioshock Infinite. This is Aaron. And Andy. And Jimmy. And Michaela. And none of that other bullshit like last episode. We're just jumping right into it. So we're supposed to find the shock jockey plasmid. I mean bigger. And use it to activate some kind of gondola thingy. Ooh, doesn't this look exciting? We're looking yeah. at desks. I see you didn't put a cover sheet on your TPS report. Oh, oh, oh. we're gonna get in trouble with Bothman now. We're gonna write you up. Ooh, what's this? Is there stuff over here? I like I stuff. I see something shining on the floor. Lockpicks. You want to? <laughs> One more, and I can open the safe. Are those lockpicks? You mean like permanent? the safe on Reddit that hasn't been opened in like two months? Don't start that. that. No, seriously, do you get to keep those picks, or are they used whenever you open something? They're used whenever you open something. Because apparently it. that's Serious. how lock picks work. Ah! Where the... Why were you hiding in the bathroom? Oh, no. Maybe there was you. Here you go! <laughs> That'll do. Did, he throw, did she just throw a coin to you in the middle of the no, no, she threw health to me, which is oh. awesome because I was about to die. You that see, is that is the useful function of Elizabeth. Whenever you need something badly, she somehow manages to find it. Well, she might stock up on stuff like you do. That looked like a lunchbox you just picked up. Like a I mean, that was ammo. Oh, okay. Ammo box. Okay. Use the toilet. Hey, you don't have to pay for the toilets. <laughs> oh. Okay. Of course, Andrew because Ryan. Anne Rand lover Andrew Rot. Oh my god. <laughs> Why the fuck didn't I realize they have the same initials? Ayn Rand and Andrew Ryan. Oh my god! <laughs> I am a freaking idiot. We are sorry for you guys just losing your ears. We are full of guys. <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> Aaron just blew his own mind. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, yeah. <laughs> cool, he lost his shit. He got to, it together. To be fair, Aaron, I didn't realize that either. Then again, I didn't think that hard. To be fair, and I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> and to be fair, I don't know who Ayn Rand is all that much. <laughs> all right. She wrote a book back. and... Why is there a lockpick <laughs> in the bathroom? Great. That must have been some serious <laughs> shit going on in here. <laughs> no, ser serious like shit. Oh, fuck, I locked the curtain. The shock jockey product. No, no, no. Oh, fuck, my ass is now clenched. I need some way to undo this. Oh well, <laughs> this is the only thing I have. Oh God. But what? now that I have five. I uh, thought you needed three. Nope, I needed five. Oh. You want to know something about Bioshock? Think you can pick this? Right? Let me have a they, look. They made a city underwater. And Badass. Andrew Ryan, he said, there you go. everything runs by money. And then everything got <laughs> fucked up by money. And no then sense. water kept going down. So that's how that went down. And now oh. they're in the clouds. Hmm. These ones. No relation to anything as of yet. No. There's literally no connection other than similar themes. I was shocked one and two were related. This one is like completely out. Yes! At this current Hold on! Woo! Why is it a horse? I'm just gonna drink this. Oh shit, you're tripping off. It's not. Is it electroshock? That is fucking Bronco. Press oh, to no, launch no. your enemies the into it? the air. Hold and release to create an eruptive trap. I love I like those how little your videos. Enemy is Satan. Yep. But fucking yep. Bronco is my favorite vigor next to crows. When we strike, we will teach oh. Case in point. A lesson. Now, I know you all want to make a slate as some show kind us, of war hero. But let me be show abundantly us, clear. Hold on. Cornelius Slate is no son of a bitch. Everybody's dead. Most people are dead. Pretty much, on, except 
That's just what happens when you die by fucking Bronco. Headshot. And this is why I gave him a shotgun for this. Rain. No, I named the shotgun sweetness. I always name the shotgun sweetness. Oh, hi there. Yep. You're the one licking the mic. I don't want to stand up. Get rid of that thing. The only you just give a wink of a gun. Like it. Yep. Like it, like if it was like Fallout, you know, where you can give your companions like, armor and weapons. And they would completely disobey your orders and not have to listen to combat and die, so you had to reload your last save because you couldn't fall in the Hey, look. I and no, I'm not the only person that had to reload a save or last save. <laughs> Bethesda ruined my life. Watch out, Crow! Did she just say what I... Shit. Not this asshole again. Oh, Jesus. Hi there! Oh, no. Oh, God. Hi there! Oh, my God. And again. Pretty much. All that code is fake with her. She's a too big of an edge around the hole. Oh my god, really? Willy, we're going there. I like that girl. Well, let's see. I already made jokes about men and zombies. So, oh, and obviously Hitchcock. So, there's only so many references I can make. I think those tears of yours might come in handy next time we're in a scrape. Well, there has to be a tear around for me to use. I can't just pull them out of thin air. Don't most guns? Okay, so... I'm supposed to go... Uh, that way. However, there's Who's that? Slate. I actually know the fellow. Seems he's still got a knack for making enemies. This microphone smells like pool. But anyway, he just explained that the guy who is currently kind of running uh, this Wait, area, bro, Cornelius Slade, was. Well, he sounds like a villain. He's not actually a villain. He's just really, really doesn't like Comstock because. Want to hold on to this? Sure. Why did she just throw money at you? She found it, and I'm the only one who can carry shit, apparently. She huh. cannot carry it in between her breasts. <laughs> Although, if you see her later outfits, you're wondering why she can't. <laughs> but anyway, as I was saying, the Cornelius Slade guy, he re really hates Comstock because... Cornelius Slade was in the army, fought in, like, you know, the Battle of Wounded Knee and all that kind of stuff. Comstock said he did, and was the hero of, like, every battle. Well, fucking kill stealer. <laughs> Bullshit, you were. Yeah, you Bull were a nurse. Kill steal. You were, <laughs> you were my yeah. towel boy. Yeah. Oh, oh, and, and, by and the way, uh, here's a little nifty thing. Hold on. Is that blood on the wall? Oh. Yes, it is. Hi. Mr. DeWitt? Look, a cipher. Secret message from the Vox Populi. You're the junior code Shush. breaker. What's it say? Don't know. There should be a code book somewhere. I just got a secondary quest. Oh, and by the way, Andy, if you carry rusty coins between your boobs, the rust rubs off and your boobs turn green. I learned that one the hard way when I found a penny in my bra one day. Well, you found then. a penny in your bra. You didn't put it in there? I don't remember <laughs> putting it in there. It's like, ooh, but a penny. But shit happens. Penny. Yeah. Okay 
right then. <laughs> hey, so, hey, when your boobs are wicked green, you get really concerned. Oh, man. How would you like it if your balls turned green? That would be concerning. Wait, they're not normal? Oh, shit. You might need to go Andy, to I think I need to go to a hospital. <laughs> 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 but anyway, we're supposed to find a code book. They shoved it in the cannon here. Found something. That's really good hiding right. spot, sir. <laughs> Ten feet away in the cannon. I like how it's no the more in the building across from there. Well, it's better than the last secondary one where we had to travel like halfway across the current area. To yeah. Ooh, I see a shiny. Get the shiny. Oh. Oh, oh God. Interesting. What oh, hi there. Wait. Did she just say interesting? <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was scared about killing people. She is interested. That was, was that just held on the wall with a knife? Yes, it was. Some dude just went in here slinging knives around. I like this person here, already. Throw it up right now. Anyway, so now that like you five tries well, now that you find the there. code book. Hey, looks simple enough. Tip the hat to the Vox. Well, there must be more to this place than meets the eye. Oh, no. Never mind they wrote it in blood. She doesn't care anymore. Well, I'm supposed to tip a hat hmm. to Vox. Hat. Tip of the hat. Indeed. Ho, 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 ho. That was a fancy hat. Okay. It was a fancy hat. You want your hat. It was like the best hat we found at the mall. You'd think that somebody walking into the bathroom would try to hang a coat up and go, holy crap, a secret entrance. Let's just close that back up. Here. I'm just going to ignore this because I don't want to get into any sort of revolutionary shenanigans. Now, if you excuse me, <laughs> box of phone. Daisy Fitzroy. I've read about her. Of course you have. Of course Columbia from the sky. Everybody's got a dream. <laughs> here we go. Ba boom Freaking cannon. Boom stick. <laughs> and mystical glowing thingy. Right Sir, there. don't drink anything that changes colors in front of your eyes. Nice. Oh Lucky well, found people. Do they listen? No. Well, you know, it seemed like the other two Bioshock games were more for, like, heroin addicts, because then you were just injecting random shit into your arm. Now you're just drinking random shit, so now you're an alcoholic. So I guess that's better than a heroin oh. addict. So then when it'll move on to Give all yourself all up. random shit? That was him falling forward. I just ripped his face off. Don't mind me, I just, you know, I forgot my gun in the other room of the RV. <laughs> if you'll be a gentleman and please wait for this fight to start. Remember, Aaron, steal everything that's not nailed down. If that Aaron? chair isn't nailed down, fucking take it. <laughs> I will demonstrate the power of the boomstick when the proper moment arrives. You will know when What's that proper system? moment arrives. But first, if I remember correctly, besides the cannon, there was some useful stuff in here. Well, this is France circa 1912, so they should be losing a few wars by this point. No, <laughs> no, hold on a second. Not on, not in their country, only in Africa. They're still losing. Now remember, they didn't lose, they just surrendered. They, they lost <laughs> their own civil war. <laughs> they also yeah, that is France, bad. where the tanks only go in reverse. <laughs> <laughs> They also invented such pretty words as palatial and the magic lock. Now, excuse me. Huzzah! Ow. <laughs> Don't mind me, I just Now back into the hands. building I just jumped <laughs> off of. I was Don't too mind lazy me, I to just shattered it. all the bones in my foot. I just broke quick. three of my legs. Um, <laughs> ammo if you need it. It's only fair oh, that you be a cut of the cost, I think. Remember, you're covered by the plot shield. One of them still kind of stiff. 
Oh my god, eat all the cotton candy. Yes. Cotton candy forever. Ooh. So Aaron, are you worried about being killed by the floor at all in this game? Shut it. That didn't happen. What? what? That didn't happen! Did I miss what? something? I was not here for this. Which so reminds you though, Aaron. Carbine, here we go. There is an old ultimate game in which one of the enemies is the floor, so... <laughs> Ah, it'd be right up your alley. I like how the shield works even if you're taking damage. Oh. Like I'm missing a, a single lock money. pick. Catch! Nice <laughs> toss. You know <laughs> She threw it through the camera. <laughs> you know what this shield in this game reminds me of? Besides the energy shield from Halo? No, it's the shield from Doom. Oh yeah. If you try to attack somebody, you can shield on somebody but you shut down gondola axe. Really Listen, because of what's going through. on with that man's sleep. I guess it would be like well, I suppose we could take those skylines above us. We just need to find a way to clear up that cargo first. This is going to be fantastic. She's really excited about um, lo lo riding those skylines. That keen eye of yours could find some ammunition lying around. I sure could use it when there's trouble. It'll take some scrounging, but I'll do my best. I can imagine. Now a little bit. Yeah, now if you excuse me. The line's clear. Huzzah! <laughs> Oh shit. Which way is up? Um, I think I. <laughs> I. She's what? much better at it than you are. <laughs> what the hell? What? What did you do? I. I somehow landed on this train car. <laughs> well. oh, I, I what? What? Where? What? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what? This is the. Face. Are you sure this is the first time you've done this? <laughs> this is intensely entertaining. I think I'd rather watch this for a while. <laughs> I think I think this is a signal that all reason has now gone away and that we should end the episode. Yeah. So, next time we are going to ride the skylines correctly <laughs> and try and get the shock jockey bigger. Uh, so I could electrocute some things. Fun. So, this has been Aaron. And Andy. And Jimmy. And Michaela. And we will see you next time.